Right, it's going to be a bit windy. I've come to this gate. I might have to go back. Uh, what I'm going to do is just walk to the edge there, because there's a load of cows there, but I'm not sure if they're fenced off from me. I'll just zoom in to let you know. There's a cows in the corner of the field there. There's some in the field on the other side as well. Right. And there's a gate open, actually. And then you've got a big herd there. And there, and there, and there. But I don't know if they're fenced off or is that where I normally go? I don't know, but I've got to walk to the end. Risk walking to the end. Past the big stone. The only way I'll know is by walking to the end. If they're the other side of a fence, don't forget I've got one group over there. It's a split herd. What I remember about these lot, they aren't exactly friendly. Um, it depends if they're going to make my great their way over here. It's going to be quite windy. There's ponies in here. They've never bothered me up till now. Um, but I don't know if that corner of the field is where I normally am close to. I can't remember. I won't know until I get up there. If they're fenced off and they're in another field, then there isn't any problem. Cow pack. If not, I've got to go back. I don't mind going back because I, I, I half want to do the West Mendip way. And I've allowed time for this. All right, I've allowed time for it. What we don't want is to bump into them. So what I have to do, <coughs> they could be in another field. That's shut off from me. But if they're not, I've got to make a decision. And I think it's going to be difficult to do it. Because the cows in the other side of that wall have actually got access to another part of the walk that I've got. Um, I won't know until I get round this corner if those cows are at, in the risk area for me. I mean, quite often I've walked straight through there, but near the ruins, and just the other side of a great big tree, Right, there is another herd of cows. Because sometimes I walk straight down there. This is the risks, but there are cows do come in here. It does look like cows have been in here. I can't tell yet. I won't know until I get to what I call the stone. If they're not in here, then I can carry on. But I, if I have to turn back, I don't care. Because I half want to risk the West Mendip way anyway. But if they're not a threat to me, that lot there, I can't really tell, you see. I can't really tell till I get round the corner. I can't really tell if there's a wall separating me from them. It could be that there is a wall. Because look, there's a wall there. No sign of cows going down through the main bit. I've got a feeling, it depends if there's a... Oh, I've just trod in a load of cow back. It depends if there's a... You've got to go closer, Sheila, because you've got to make sure. you really got to make sure that fence is secure. You don't want a gap. Okay, you don't want a gap. I can see cows over there. I think we're all right. I think this is a sealed end. Let me look. I'm going across. No. Over there is the herd, right? See? Now they're all sat down. And as far as I know, they haven't spotted me. But I'm still at risk because those cows have got access 
aren't everywhere I'm going, but these aren't. Um, these are in another area, but they are still in an area I might want to get in. Now, you, those of you who don't know and wonder why I'm talking about cows all the time, cow pack, is because, and there could be a herd in these bushes, by the way, I've got to be alert all the time. There could be a whole herd just behind that row of bushes there. It's because I was chased by cows once. Okay? I'm always looking for my ways out. I'd jump over that fence if I had to now. Uh, I'm just going to zoom into the herd that are lying down over there. Yeah, they all look very sleepy. And then over there we've got another herd. They're all lying down. All I'm worried about, are there any in, in these bushes? It's harder for me to get over here. Let me just see, I thought I saw something brown then. You've got to have very sharp eyes. I, mean, I don't need glasses when I'm doing long sighted stuff. Now where was that gap I saw? Oh, I can't see it now. Through there. It is a risk. It's a definite risk. But I'd like you to know that. I actually saw a bloke get over a stile into a field today, nearly walk straight into the face of a massive bull, the bull just stood and stared at him. The bloke... Just very fresh cow back here. Um, the bloke... Um, uh, they're all seem to be going up that way at the moment as well. He was going to track around the wall. And what happened was... Um, a big black and white cow stood in his way and wouldn't move and just stared at him. Uh, he obviously felt threatened, so he had to climb the wall. Now, he could have been in that other field anyway. He probably didn't know about the other style, but that was a good learning curve for me and a reminder to me and to all my followers. I'm taking a risk now because I haven't got a clue if there's any massive herd hiding in these bushes. Because there's cow pack. That could be from the herd over there. That could be from the herd that left um, earlier. There are, I, I always look for ways out. That's a good way to get over there. But then you're going straight into another field of cows, you see. Right over there, look. Right over there, we've got our aerials. Remember the Velvet Bottom Walk? Passed them both ways this year. Those cows are happy up there. This should lead me to a gate to get on a route towards Cheddar. Um, I'm just going to keep quiet for a minute. It could be the farmer led herd out from here earlier that I seen going through the field near by near Draco's lines. But cows do shelter in bushy areas when it's windy. I've just got to keep an eye out. And you can see all evidence of cow cow activity in the mud. This is the sort of place I like to shelter. But at the moment I've got a feeling fingers crossed by the way that they've moved off a lot of this is fresh but I don't think they're here at the moment they could be ahead of me look, go back I could come face to face with something in a minute I'm keeping a close eye on every single way out which is diving over if you have to dive 
that, see that track going up there? That's when the llamas are in the field over that way. That's a walk I'm hoping to do soon. And if there are no cows over that way, I'll be doing it sooner than I think. I could even do it tomorrow. That's what good idea is to come up here. You can see the, the lie of the land. Because that's black rock over there, you see. Right. This is what I do when I'm in the countryside. Sometimes I know there's cows around, but you, if you know cows have got a habit, they move about. This pack here has dried out, it isn't quite as fresh. Um, but the farmer might have moved this lot. Because in the drove there was evidence of very fresh pack. Now, just down here, there should be a gate in a minute. And it's also a good idea if I look when I'm here to see where, if there's any cows going up that way, because there's a walk I follow, and it goes all the way along the top there. Those cows are up there. They usually have freedom to go up that end, right? I can see the gate now. I've managed to get through. Now, of course, another way I do go, which I did last time, is straight down the middle there. And I might not have done it, but I got a feeling I came out twice last, uh, last time. Um, and what you could be is very alert, because through there, I'll just zoom in, there's a round circular object, and that is a pothole. Now, quite often, I, I pass that pothole en route across the fields there and down into Cheddar that way. Right. Now, fortunately for me, at the moment, the cows have been this side and they've moved. Right, they've moved. Now, are they going to be in this other area that I want to go in? I can't see any evidence of any here. There's another type of slides up there. But cows do quite often gather all around here. Now, a risk I'm going to take in a minute is going through that gate. That gate leads me to the field where that big herd is, but that big herd has moved up to the top. Right? If not, it looks quite clear here to go straight down to Cheddar that way. But if the cows were in here, there, look, back. If the cows... Lots and lots of pack here. If the cows, and they've taken away the sign, I'm sure you used to be able to be allowed to go through here. I've got to climb over here now. The cows are all up there. There's a little lane over there that I'll be following. Hoping that all the cows are up that way and I'm not going to bump into them by the drinking hole. Right, over and out everyone, but I'm just looking over there to see if I can see any cows out. Over there. Wait a minute. That's a track I want to go up, which I've been up loads of times. The llama field's up there. I can't see any evidence of cows in that field at all. Sometimes they're down in Black Rock though. No, I don't. I reckon I'll be able to do that soon. Is that somebody? Right, I'm turning off. I'm just gonna. Here's the farm. Over and out for a minute, folks.